A splendid day for football here in North London at the Emirates Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Arsenal up against Leeds United. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And the match begins. Cleef. Bamford. And there to intervene. to try his luck and denied only by the post well the keeper was beaten he hit it so cleanly it's just the wrong side of the post Tierney. Arsenal could threaten from this position. Space and time for the cross. Sends it back. Real chance. Oh, that was a chance to give them an early advantage. Well, they should be off to a flyer here, and that was a poor effort. He must hit the target. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Xhaka. It did look on for them, but not to be. Mateusz Klich. Bamford. Now they've lost it. Kieran Tierney. Gabriel Martinelli. Oh, he's gone for goal. And the keeper showing tremendous command. Now, how about the short corner? Marcinelli. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Not increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. Keen to take it short here. The cut back. And no way through. Excellent challenge. Tierney. Lacazette prepared to fire. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant.
And short it is. Marcinelli. Xhaka. And just narrowly wide. Well, it's a good effort from that range, but I think the keeper had it covered. Harrison. And that'll end up being the keeper's ball. Well, as we've seen, Arsenal have dominated the ball in the last 15 minutes and created a hatful of chances. But when you're enjoying that amount of possession... Oh, Stuart, they might be onto something here. And saved by the keeper. He's driven in the corner. It hasn't come to very much. Lacazette. Partey. It needs an accurate cross. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Marcinelli using his physical strength to shield it. Untidy on the ball. He went in so dangerously with that tackle. Now, the referee is the man everyone's looking at. And it is red. He's been given his marching orders. Well, it's a definite red. He's put his team under a lot of pressure now. Arsenal's free kick here. <laughs> Granite Jacker. Happy to take on the shot. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. He's feeling the pressure here. Chance to play it in. Lacazette! Brilliant save. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. So the corner played into the box. Well, no end product. Xhaka. Saka. Tierney. It's with Erdogan. The crossbar got in the way. And clears the danger. It is a decent looking attack here. Thomas. Good tackle taken away. And the counter looks on here. Options available. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Really good interception. Martin Odegaard. Now Lacazette. Partey. It's with Erdogan. And that's a well-timed pass. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here.
Well, he was one of their better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, he did have that effort that hit the woodwork, and he certainly worked hard to get into the match. But sure, he could add a bit more quality to his game in the second 45 to have a real impact on as anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Llorente. And in the perfect position to read it. Martin Odegaard still passing it around with authority and a goal they've taken the lead well playing a man short but that doesn't seem to bother them we shouldn't be surprised well here it is again and wow just take a look at this he's absolutely nailed this one what a strike that is from distance So underway again here, 1-0 the score. Using his physique to shield the ball and then wait for others to get there. Promising sequence. But they dealt with the threat first. Lacazette. Tierney. Space and time for Arsenal. Xhaka. Now Lacazette. Well timed tackle. An alert intervention. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Granit Xhaka. Martin Odegaard. Saka. And return to Lacazette. Tierney. This looks interesting. Well, as the replay shows us, this is the way to beat tight marking. Just look how he turns with the ball. That's a fantastic goal, you have to say. So, 2-0 now. Oh, with Junior Firpo here. Patient build up at the moment. We're racing away here. Good looking cross. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. On a time for composure on the ball. Well, the stats don't lie. Arsenal have had most of the possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. Saka. It's with Takahiro Tomiyasu. Martin Odegaard. Moving it forward. Lovely incisive pass. Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? Yeah. 
Time for a change then. And deciding to go short with this one. He's in control of the situation. Getting in there to intercept. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Not to be this time. Ailing. Well, this game ebbing away, and Arsenal have been brilliant, Stuart. Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously being fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy unless they have the ball, and they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round. Lacazette. I'd be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Rafinha. On to Bamford. Rafinha. Chance to cross. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Takes the shot. Superb block. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Poor shot. And the referee blows his whistle. Now we can say it officially. Arsenal have won this game. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area. And they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Well, a leading and guiding role played by Martin Odegor. Sensational performance on all levels. Stuart, your assessment of his production? Well, he scored a good goal. He hit the woodwork and was a constant threat. So overall, he should be really pleased with his display today.